Short journey west for Leeds United this lunchtime to take on local rivals Huddersfield Town. Leeds looking to continue their good run against a side that struggled since returning to the Championship. Pablo Hernandez has gone to spot the ball up now on the near side touchline. Costas come short, but everybody else waits for the longer ball in the penalty area, and it comes in now towards the penalty spot. Breaks out for Alioski! Oh, what a strike! What a strike from Alioski there through a crowd of players, and it flies one bounce into the back of the net. Harrison down the left-hand side, bodies in the box, and it goes to Hernandez! Oh, what a goal that is from Pablo Hernandez! Brilliant, brilliant breakaway football from Leeds United. From back to front, and Pablo Hernandez with the header at the far post. Jenny, you happy with today's win? Of course. Um, it's a, it was a special game, derby game, and uh, it's good that Leeds can win here, we took the three points and again a clean sheet, it's very important for the team because it shows how hard we work in the, in the defence and uh, then uh, we got gonna, gonna create always chances to score and uh, it was a difficult game but on the end uh, I think we deserve it. So Leeds United still without Liam Cooper for this game this evening and just one change to the starting eleven. The game is very, very open. Hernandez, that's a lovely ball, into Helder Costa in the penalty area, cuts the ball back, it's gone in! It's an own goal! And Leeds United make the breakthrough, and it comes from a perfect pass from Hernandez. Carries the ball right up towards the edge of the penalty area, into the box, oh, it's hit the inside of the post from Bamford, Alioski! Oh, my word! What a response from Leeds United, it could have been 1-1. We knew it was going to be difficult. I think you've got to give them a lot of credit. They come here, they had a go, um, as we knew they would. They were dangerous. On, we knew they were dangerous on the counter, and uh, we knew if we defend it well, we would get chances going forward. And uh, you know, it, it took us to the second half, but again, we showed grit and determination to grind out a result. And Harrison does really well. There's a chance for a break from Leeds here. They've got bodies up quickly and the ball is played out quickly towards Helder Costa and Helder Costa's in the penalty area oh yes what a start to the game for Leeds United another brilliant brilliant breakaway now Dallas picks it up on the edge of the penalty area Mendes Lang puts a foot in Dallas with a cross Bamford's in the clear Patrick Bamford makes it 2-0 Leeds United takes the ball down on his chest and sweeps it home what a start this is Patrick Bamford slides the ball in cool and calm as you like he gets his second goal of the game chips the ball up and Kiko Garcia comes and flaps a bit at that one and Tomlin lifts it towards goal and into the back of the goal and Lee Tomlinson Lee Tomlin has picked up on the poor the cross is delivered and danger area oh it's an own goal it's come off Ben White at the far post as Eddie Nketiah chases oh and he's brought he's taken out there by Morrison well that at the very least is a yellow card as the card oh it's red it's a red card he went straight through on Nketiah who'd gone beyond and Cardiff have it far side and Tomlin with a flick up towards the edge of the penalty area and there's a chance for the goal, it's an equaliser Cardiff have pulled it back and Glatzel it was who stole in behind the Leeds back line and honestly uh, the lads are good I feel like it's something you can't, if you're a promotion team you can't be 3-0 up and end up drawing the game and the boys know that and it's a tough one to take because if you look at the game as a whole we've absolutely dominated them and it could have been a lot more, we could have scored a lot more, but we knew what their threat was, and it turns out that was how they got the goals. Two players from Leeds in front of him, chips it up to the far post, Mitrovic waits, and it's in the danger area in the six-yard box, and there's a push, and the referee has awarded Fulham a penalty kick for a little push in the back from Ben White there. His scoring tally for the season, and it's hit the post, and it's in to the back of the net. Alioski down the channel, and Ketia does well to spin and drive the shot in. Yeah. Patrick Bamford taps in the rebound, and Leeds United are all square. Comes in now towards the near post, bounces up towards Mitrovic, who tries the volley. Ben White behind him, and it's driven into the back of the net. Quite difficult at the moment, obviously. Um, with their first goal, 
you know, there's a lot of controversy about it, um, but we can't say too much about that. A um, bit sloppy to concede the second, but um, I think you know overall we did well. Um, you know we deserved a, a point at least I think in the game, and you know possibly three points the where we attacked. And Leeds now have to count, uh, are on the, could be caught on the counter because Preston have got bodies up to the, to the edge of the penalty area. And there's the opening goal of the game on the break, Alan Brown. Jack Harrison lifts the ball up, it goes over all the way to Luke Ayling, far side of the box, comes out to the edge of the area, and it's in from Stuart Dallas. It takes a deflection on its way, but Dallas's rising shot carries up into the top corner and Leeds right at the end have themselves an equaliser. First half, we're well below the standards we've set ourselves, we know that. They're a good side, they come here, the press is high, they unsettled us and uh, you've got to give them credit, they're a hard-working team, well set up. But you know, In the second half when we got going, it only really looked like it was going to be one winner towards the end and you know, unfortunately we couldn't, we couldn't win the game, but if you can't win it, we've got to make sure we don't lose it. And the two sides are all set to emerge from the tunnel which just gives me the opportunity to introduce, first of all, our special guest alongside us on LUTV this afternoon, and that is Leeds United's number nine, Patrick Bamford. Harrison was being held there by Cowley momentarily. Harrison with the ball oh, through the middle. Up. It's held at Costa! Yes. Here's Leeds United's opening goal of the game, and it is that counter-attack that we talked about. Birmingham City go close at one end, but Leeds United go at the other end. Chance for Helder at the near post. Might come to Inketi, might come to Alioski. Yes. Chance deflected and in. Well, it was a ball that took a heavy deflection on the way through, but it does not matter because Leeds have got their second goal in the game here. Poland with the ball in towards the penalty area, and they have one back. Birmingham fans behind Kiko Casillas' goal, urging their team forward as it goes to the back post area. Casillas comes, no way, and Birmingham out. City have got a goal back, and it's Lukas Djokovic. Ailing, that's a lovely touch away from the substitute. Ailing's going to go for goal! Oh. Ailing has found the back of the goal. What a strike that is! He goes away to celebrate in front of those travelling Leeds United fans. There was no stopping that. Now the ball is delivered in towards that penalty area, and there's a chance and a goal. And Birmingham City have another one. Leeds on the attack again. <laughs> Might come back here to Ailing. Ailing's oh. balling. Yes! Oh, yes! Stuart Dallas has got one again. And Leeds are back in front. You cannot take your eyes off this game. Bayer bringing the ball forward. He's got plenty to aim for in the middle. Comes on the way. And Djokovic has converted it. Here's Helder Costa. There's players in the penalty area. In towards Ailing. Ailing drives that one across. Yes! yes! Leeds have got their Get fifth in. goal! Is it Luke Ayling oh. again, you know? We've come here to win the game. Doesn't matter how we've done it, we've done it. Uh, but yeah, a lot of emotions today. It was a roller coaster. Uh, you know, we've, we went 2-0 up. Uh, we're cruising at that stage. And then the momentum swings, they get themselves back into it. The crowd get behind them and, and we start to get sloppy. Uh, so from our point of view, we're really disappointed, obviously, that we've conceded four goals today. Um, delighted we've scored five, obviously, but there's a lot of, lot of things we can work on, of course, yeah.